should you become a full-time trader? Can you even become a part-time trader? What is the answer? Uh, I get this question all the time and there's no one right answer. You have to do what's right for you. Uh, I have students who are part-time traders and they make an extra 10,000, maybe even $50,000 a year like Tim Bowen, who's lead trainer at Stocks to Trade. Uh, click the link just below and you can learn from Tim Bowen on how to be the best part-time trader. I'll include that link because he's one of the best part-time traders that I know. I also have students like Tim Gratani who are so full-time, they're full-blown addicts. And now he's turned 1,500 of his own money into nearly six million in six years. Uh, click the link below for that too. I'll include two links. One if you wanna be a part-time trader, one if you wanna be a full-time trader. You get to choose based on your own schedule. I have students who are in school, who are truck drivers, who are cab drivers, who are security guards. Um, I have students who are, you know, stunt devils. Like you can do whatever you want in life and make the stock market work for you on your own time. Then I have some people where they're like, screw everything else. I have 10 monitors and I just wanna trade stocks. I love this job. That's cool too. I use one laptop. This is my laptop. This is it, okay? You don't even have to use a laptop. Here's my smartphone, right? You don't have to use anything you don't want to. I've heard people say, oh, you can't trade with one laptop. Really? I mean, this is what I've been doing the majority of my now nearly 20 year career. So have I just been wrong these past two decades? Uh, I know some people are like, I can never trade from a smartphone. The other day I was hanging out with Roland, one of my students who's recently gone full-time. He started out as part-time and now he's turned 4,000 into over 500,000 in roughly one year. And he made $8,000 while we were at an event and he made $8,000 from his smartphone. So there's so many different options out there. Um, you can also modulate. This is my whole kind of way of teaching where you can start out as full-time and then say, ah, this isn't for me. I do better by having more patience so I don't wanna be tempted to trade all the time. Let me go part-time. Welcome to my life. Um, some people who say, ah, you know, I'm in school. I'll, I'll just trade a little bit. I'll make a little money here or there. I'll try to. And then guess what? They graduate school and then they become full-time later on. Um, you don't have to do anything you don't want to do. And there's so much narrow-mindedness out there that people say you have to do this or you have to do that. I've been fortunate enough to travel to over 100 countries and I've met people from all walks of life. And I'll tell you that you can choose to hold stocks for a minute. You can choose to hold stocks for an hour. You can choose to hold stocks for a day. You can choose to hold stocks for a year. Whatever suits your personality and whatever you're best at. And I would encourage you to try different strategies, to try different holding periods, to try, you know, for a day, trading all day. For me, I like to actually travel a lot and, and teach a lot and, you know, focus on my charity because it keeps me focused on only trading the best plays. If I had 10 monitors and I just sat there, I would overtrade. This is one of my main problems where I overtrade if given the opportunity. So I've structured my life in a fun way, but also as a way to prevent me from overtrading. When you're in crazy time zones in Asia and I'm trading the US stock market, guess what? I really don't wanna trade in the middle of the night. So I'm forcing myself to only look for the best place. That's how much of an addict I am. Just so you know, I'm not proud of it, but I recognize how addicted I am. So I put steps in place to protect me from myself. I have students where they say, I need these monitors, I need to see what's going on in different markets and how they're correlating, and I like seven longs and three shorts, and that way I'm hedged. That's beautiful. That's not for me. I usually take one, maybe two stocks at a time max. So there is no easy answer. I'm just bringing up a whole range of potential uh, ways that you can make this work, but I want you to make the stock market work for you and your schedule. Don't become a slave to the stock market. Don't think that you have to do something one way. Uh, the world is so vast. People are so different. Your personalities are all different. You get to choose. That is the beauty of trading. It is ultimate freedom. This is not the normal nine to five job. You don't have a boss. You don't have a dress code. Um, you can do whatever you want. So you tell me, leave a comment underneath this video. Tell me if you're gonna be part-time or full-time or you know, if you trade with a laptop or a smartphone, tell me what you prefer. I'm curious to see, and I'm also gonna include some links 
between if you want to learn to be a part-time trader or if you want to learn to be a full-time trader. We have educational offerings for both, but please, whatever you do, whether you're full-time or part-time or you know, you're just starting right now, study up, okay? This is very, very front-end loaded with education. No matter what you want to do, you need to study a lot before you can get consistent at making profits. Like I brought up, Tim Grittani has turned 1500 now into nearly $6 million. His first nine months, he was break-even. So if arguably the best trader in the past few years was roughly break-even for the first nine months, guess how you will do? Especially if you're thinking about quitting your job. Guess what? You're probably not gonna have enough profits anytime soon to make up for that lost income. So if you do have a job, I would say, hey, study at night, study on weekends, try to fit in a trade here or there. But don't just quit something that pays you consistent income for a very speculative practice, which is trading. Hey, Tim Sykes, Millionaire Mentor and Trader. Thank you for watching my videos. I hope that they help you. I wanna share everything that I've learned over the years. You can check out more videos right over there. And also click subscribe so that you can watch all of these videos, get that knowledge, and become my next millionaire student.